Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to go ahead, since it's June, and go ahead and do my June favorites. Oh my God, I'm so sorry about the bananas in the background. So I'm actually in my kitchen. Um, my dining room, I have renovated into an office area. As you can see, I have my desk and my computer and stuff. I'm still in the process of decorating the entire space, but the light is coming through this way and I didn't wanna to have to put all the lights out, just do this video, so this is what you get. So once it's fully done, I'll do a video of like a little tour of my desk area, but for right now, this is what you guys are gonna get, y'all. So, um, I guess the first thing I'll do is start off with makeup. Um, I have been loving this thing called browsings. If you haven't seen my video, I actually um, started going to Benefit to get my eyebrows done, which I am loving. And I normally use the, um, Benefit has like a mascara wand type eyebrow thing. Um, I'll link it in the, um, below so that you can kind of see what I'm talking about but that's usually what I use I just kind of outline them with a pencil and just put the little mascara wax on it but um I recently went and she introduced me to browsing and this is like the packaging it comes in and basically it's just a little box and it opens up and as you can see it has a wax it has a powder it has two little slant brushes and it has a mini tweezers and I hopefully you can see that so it's focusing but it's called browsings and I've been practicing with it it can be kind of hard because you're supposed to mix the wax with the powder and put it on and once you put it on it's really hard to take off so um, I'm kind of really careful with that I'm learning and I'm practicing so we'll see how good I'm getting but I'm loving the product so um, the next thing is perfume I have been loving um, it's Blossom by Jimmy Choo. I cannot for the life of me find the damn top to this and it is driving me nuts. But anyways, I love this fragrance. Um, they used to sell in Sephora and they no longer sell in Sephora anymore. So it's one of those products where you have to just kind of buy online, but I love it. And in fact, I'm going to work, so I might as well just spray myself endlessly. Um, but this is an amazing, amazing, um, perfume. It's kind of like a fruity smell whenever I wear this I get tons and tons of compliments from people so but it's more of a sweetie fruity smell which is kind of the flavor I go for it's nothing like Bath and Body Works or that Victoria's Secret stuff that everybody wears it's not like a body spray it's actually you can tell it's a perfume spray but um, again it's one of my favorites um, that I wear pretty much all the time so I think that's all I have for beauty so my next item is these are just random accessory type stuff um is the retro bobble i love this thing and i'm gonna tell you why i purchased it but i'm just gonna give you a few details about it it's a leak proof cap uh condensation free um so you won't have any sweats or the puddles and stuff coming it is double walled vacuum sealed construction bba and lead free um it also um if you drink two of these bottles it you drink two of these full bottles to get the daily recommended water intake. Um, but the main reason I purchased this was it holds more than an entire bottle of wine. Yeah, go figure, right? <laughs> and um, it's 24 hours cold and 12 hours hot. Um, it's called the Retro Bottle from Mana, M-A-N-N-A. And again, it's amazing. It's humongous, I'm not gonna lie, but it fits an entire bottle of wine, guys. And just like I said, two of these is your water intake, so um, the retro bottle. Love it, love it, love it. So um, I haven't used it yet because I wanted to put it in my thing, but I've been dying to use it, so yeah. I'm already in love with it. I'm going to tell you right now. It's going to be in my, my bag at all times. Um, another thing I'm loving are these candles from Target. Um, I'm, it doesn't really have a name to it. Hopefully you can see them. Look at me. Huh? Um, but I got Lemon Drop and Sweet Clementine. Actually, it's fragrant. It's called Fragrance by Soy Candle. And um, it you can burn up to 45 hours with these. I have... Um, I haven't used the Sweet Clementine yet, but I have used the Lemon Drop. As you can see, it's already um, more than halfway done. But 
obviously you know what lemon drop smells like um it's pure lemons and the sweet clementine is obviously another sweet flavor um i love these soy candles they give the best smell ever so definitely check those soy candles out um these are some items that i actually got from tj maxx and they are kind of like acrylic well they are acrylic um desk accessories well they're actually i like they're not desk accessories they're um bath accessories so this is actually a toothbrush holder but um i'm in the process of figuring out what i'm going to do with this because i'm thinking i am going to use it as a pencil holder and um i just recently purchased these cute pens which they're in my car so i can't show you but they um from z gallery and they have a little crystal top so i thought these would be really cute to put inside here this box i've been using um i was going to put post-its and stuff in it but i put my espresso caps in it so it's just an acrylic box as you can see and i absolutely love them um the box is 12.99 and it's part of the hotel collection and the little toothbrush holder well the pen holder <laughs> is also hotel collection and it is ten dollars so this was a cheap set that I just love um, that just turned into what was supposed to be desk accessories now is my espresso holder. So, yeah. Um, another thing I've been loving are, um, I love my Carrick machine and I recently discovered these two items. This one I've been using for a, a, lo a long time. This is the um, sweet lemon iced tea, not sweet, it's sweet tea. Um, this other one is one that they just found and um, this is a cappuccino and it's really cool um, I don't really I try to stay away from dairy so instead of using um, what you would do is you would pour the little actually I can just show you you will pour this little packet which is kind of it contains milk it's kind of the froth so you can see it's the cappuccino froth and you pour this into your cup and then you just run the regular um, Keurig in through and it makes like a little cappuccino but of course like I said I don't really drink milk so I usually put some almond milk and just do the espresso so I do my own little thing but um, I do love this um, this version now I have tried the little packet thing and it is really really good but again you know when I can't stay away from milk I definitely definitely try to so um, those are my favorites um another favorite that i have are these little cups now i got these cups from japan um in haneda from tokyo actually and aren't these the cutest little things so this is the inside and it's kind of like hopefully i can show you that's the inside is it focusing and it's like a little cup and i use this for my green tea and I also got this little cup. As you can see, it's kind of like a, can't really describe that. And then the inside is like a ceramic, a shiny ceramic. And both of these are microwavable. Um, I don't own a microwave, so I can't microwave anything, but um, by choice. Um, but you can put them dishwasher safe. They're easy to clean, but I love these. So I usually drink my coffees in this and um, my uh, green teas in this so these are one of my favorites um another one of my favorites is these Victoria's Secret shirts guys I have pretty much every color that you can think of in this Victoria's Secret um t-shirts from pink they are amazing and in fact I want to do a video of a Victoria's Secret pink haul with all the shirts that I bought I also bought some matching shorts to match a lot of them um, they're just quick throw on type shirts and I love them they're comfortable and flowy oh there I do have a couple more things that I didn't get to do so um my camera guys this is the camera i'm actually using it is the canon um power shot g7x mark ii and i am loving it i'm loving it loving it loving it um i don't love it as much as i love my sony but it is one of my favorite cameras um that i can use as far as vlogging so definitely definitely one of my favorite things so i wanted to point that out um, there are a couple of food items I have. Sorry, something's in my mouth. Um, I discovered these two things um, at, this one I discovered from Target. It's called Off the Eden Path. 
And it's a hummus crisp but with olive oil and herbs made with real chickpeas. And there's no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives. It, um, it's not gluten-free, so if you are gluten-free, um, do not even think about this. And it does have milk ingredients, which I did not know until just now. Um, I kind of just saw hummus and grabbed it. But they're really good, and I probably would buy them again. Um, another thing that I love are these, um, Kiwan Barbecue Chips. <laughs> I have been addicted to this. this is by Simply Seven. Um, they are so good. They taste like fluffy chips that just melt in your mouth, and I love barbecue. So um, these are clean ingredients, no added preservatives, um, zero gra zero grams of trans fat, no artificial colors or flavors. It's gluten free, simple ingredients, and simply delicious. Um, you will love these Kiwan chips, guys. I promise you, you will love these. Um, one more favorite, and I think we are done, um, and that would be, um, The Housemaid's Tale. Guys, I don't know if you've seen this show before, but it is so amazing. So if you have not checked out The Handsmaid's Tale, Handsmaid's Tale, definitely, definitely check it out. You are going to love it. Um, I guess that's all for my favorites. Um, if there's a favorite that you love, just put it in the comments below. If there's something you want me to try let me know um i am going to do a lot more flight attendant videos i have got a lot of requests and from my friends and i've also got some messages from you guys that you guys love the flight attendant videos so i will definitely be posting some of those today i'm actually going to london today so i'm going to vlog some of that for you guys and um I think that's it. I wanted to thank everybody. I've reached 300 subscribers. I am super, super excited. Um, this whole journey has been new for me. And to put your life out there is is scary. Um, but I did it. Um, if you guys are a YouTuber and you want me to check out your channel, I love supporting other YouTubers. So please put your link in the comments below or message me. And I definitely will check that out. And um, I guess if you're not a subscriber, subscribe today. And I think that's it, guys. Um, I have to get ready because I got to go to work. So I will see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> Bye, guys.